Learning how to make games on Sandbox is probably going to be one of the biggest questions that many people want to know about. And if you're coming from either Unity, Unreal, Godot, or even Roblox Studio, and you're interested in making something for Sandbox, this video should have you covered. But before we start, depending on the time that you're watching this video, either in the past or the future, these resources will be updated and will be more informative and detailed compared to the time of this video. Regardless, link this specific video to a friend who's interested and all info provided in the video will be in the description down below. Otherwise, let's get started. There's no other better place to start than the official Sandbox documentation page. The specific page on here we're looking at is the first steps section. This page will provide you with a simple and brief idea of what you need to know. Also, if you scroll down to the bottom of the page, it will have a link that you can click on that will take you directly to the Sandbox Discord if you ever need direct help and assistance from the community. Also, there's a dedicated beginners channel, which you should always start off in before jumping into general dev. Next is a cheat sheet that Punch provides through the documentation. If you're wondering why you'd ever need this, well, this page provides you information of code that you'll most likely be using all the time. And if you're coming from other engines, this will most likely be incredibly helpful to speed up the process. Or as a quick description of this page is, sometimes you know what you're looking for, but don't know where it is. The Sandbox documentation page itself is a great way to learn and understand what you want in detail. Once you know the basics, you could start to pick and choose other aspects to use when making your games. And as a note, Facepunch is constantly updating this page with new documentation as of this video. And for anyone viewing it in the future, most likely the game is either finished or there's new features that will get added documentation to this page. Regardless, it's the best place to learn Sandbox and also the best to start. Moving on to some additional resources outside of the official documentation is some Sandbox YouTube channels to recommend. First off is Smallfish's videos. Smallfish is one of the many indie dev groups in the community that's been making games and tutorials on how to start creating games on Sandbox, and also covering the basics of what to learn as a beginner. If you're a person who's a visual learner, then not only Small Fish's videos will help you immensely, but my next suggestion will help you with more info to dive into. Next, we have Carson's tutorial videos. Carson provides a variety of Sandbox tutorials that make it very easy to follow and jump around with added timestamps to learn specific aspects of his videos. Also, huge shout out to Carson for assisting me in providing help with the best resources around for this video to help you guys get started quickly. Lastly, we have the official Sandbox API page. Now this page provides a way for you to search through the code API directly and see what each function does for a certain task and how to use them in your code. With these resources provided, now you have enough info to get started on making a game on Sandbox. And if you're interested and want to know about the recent updates on Sandbox, check out this video right here. And thank you for watching.